Hi, I'm Jessica. Welcome to my channel. Uh, today I have a quick message for you guys and it's all about release, releasing negativity. Okay. It's, um, it's very important that we keep a positive mindset right now because we are entering the lion's gate portal, which is, uh, they call it the eight, eight portal. And, um, and it's all about manifesting and uh, manifesting pretty much at a rapid speed. And so your thoughts become things and, um, and the things that you put, whatever you put your intention towards will manifest um, a lot easier. So as I said, your thoughts become things. So we need to keep things positive because when we think about negative um, things, then that's kind of the life we start shaping for ourselves. Um, this is the card that I pulled and it's from the power deck. Um, and it's number 42, release. And I'm going to read this to you. Anytime you are possessed by an emotion that you cannot control, know that it does not belong to you. Someone is sending negative energy towards you. Imagine that the negative emotion is muddy water pouring down through your hands, legs, feet, and into the earth. Or take that emotion into your hands and release it like a hawk and let it fly away. We tend to hold on to fears and negative energy in an addictive way. Release your fears and let power come into you. Create a welcoming void within through the power of release. Okay, so that is just letting things go and let it flow. Whenever you have something negative, a negative thought inside of your head, um, just release it. Don't hold on to that because it will fester and it will cause your body damage. It will make you sick. You just think about how when you get really stressed out, your whole body starts to shut down, like your immune system and your nervous system and everything, your heart. You know, when, when your body is out of alignment and you have that stress, um, everything's just kind of like a, it's like a snowball effect and everything gets bad. Um, when your mental state's bad, your physical state gets bad. So we want to release negativity right now that's the that's the word for today release positive vibes only high vibe tribe in effect <laughs> so yeah um I, I threw some cards down and we have the five of cups two of pentacles seven of cups so basically there's you know if you're going through something that's disappointing like you're having some disappointment in your life like you have the choice to make a decision of being happy or sad and and how you deal with that how you deal with that disappointment, okay? And it's really all about seeing things from a different perspective, okay? So with the hangman, which was underneath. So when, when, we, when we face a certain type of disappointment in our lives, we have the choice to be mad and hold on to resentment and let it fester and just, you know, let it get us down and put us in that really bad state. Or we have the option of, you know, saying, well, it is what it is and let it go and let it flow. You know, sometimes there's just nothing we can do about a situation. Other times we can take action and fix things, you know, but it's, um, it, it, if you just want to sit around and, and worry about things all the time, it's going to really take an effect on you. So I am not a medical professional. Do not take advice from me. Um, however, um, yeah, this is for entertainment purposes only as a disclaimer, but, um, but, <laughs> but anyways, just, um, you, you, we need to release the negativity and just try to be positive. Try to see the positive side of everything. Keep on the sunny side, as the song says, always on the sunny side. Um, but let it go and let it flow. See things, try to see the good in everything. Okay, even in a bad situation, look at it not so much as a bad negative situation and like this is ruining my life or whatever. Look at it as what lesson did I learn, you know, from any kind of past mistakes or disappointments in your life. It's not, you know, don't let it weigh you down like, oh, you know, I'm kicking myself over this every day that happened. Um, look at it as, wow, I learned a lesson. I'm never going to do that again. You know, never going to date that kind of person again or, you know, whatever it is, learn from it and move on. Okay. Let's just learn from it and move on. Um, so yeah, think about what you want to manifest for the, the, 
for the near future and for the distant future. And now's the time to do it. This uh, landscape portal is a time of manifesting. Uh, the vibrational frequencies will be very high. So make sure that your vibrational frequency is high. So be sure you're eating foods that are, you know, of higher vibrational frequency and, um, and getting a lot of rest and, uh, and just surrounding yourself with good people or just not being around anybody because dagnabbit everybody's kind of, a lot of people are in uh, low vibe, you know, a lot of people are, but then a lot of people are in high vibe. So just be selective about who you have around you and who comes into your home. Okay. Um, all right, I'm going to pull a couple of just cards just to see if there's anything else that the universe would like for us to, to discuss today. Okay. All right, be peace. All these are upside down. All right, and okay. So find your peace. Be peaceful. Find a, find a happy place. We got the dove spirit. Be peace. So release all of that negativity, any kind of negativity, negative thoughts that come into your being and um, release them so you can find peace. When you find peace within, that's where happiness comes from. You know, just, uh, just be peaceful. Co-create with spirit. This is you manifesting the life that you want. This is manifesting anything that you want and need. Um, let the universe know that, let God know that you, this is, this is what you want. And, um, and they're going to be conspiring to get that to you. Okay. Um, and take some time out. You know, take time out, uh, get some rest and um, take, take the time out to decide exactly where you want to be and who you want to be with and um, what kind of life you want. So, um, you know, the goal is to just li have to live a peaceful life, to be happy. You know, it's not to live in fear and discontentment with a bunch of, you know, uh, low vibing, you know, people that don't have your best interests at heart. You need, as you, you know, raise your vibration and you let go of negativity, that's not going to be attracted to you anymore. So if you find yourself in a position where you're feeling down a lot and, and you know, a lot of times they say, um, you may not be depressed. You might just be surrounded by assholes. <laughs> sorry, not sorry. It's the truth. It's the truth. So, um, just watch who you're surrounding yourself with. And, uh, if you find yourself surrounded by a-holes, um, you know, go find some new friends. I mean, just saying, just saying. All right, let's pull a couple of these cards and, uh, let's see. Oh my gosh. So we have regret and relationships. Regret. I know that I cannot change the past. All right, don't be sulking and worrying about what happened in your past, okay? The past is the past. We have to let, let it go and move on, okay? Uh, we learn our lessons and, uh, and we become wiser and more strong in learning those lessons. And then we move forward with much more wisdom and grace and confidence. So um, have no regrets. Or in the tattoo community, it's have no regrets. <laughs> Right? You know, people spell that wrong on tattoos sometimes. So anyways, no regrets. <laughs> Maybe I'll title this video, no regrets. Okay. Um, also relationships. I am attracted to those people who serve my higher good. Whoop, whoop. Yep. I just said that. We, um, when you are high vibing, you're going to attract high vibing people. So, um, just attract those people. That's like your mantra. Have this as your mantra this week. I am attracted to, or I am attracting those people who serve my higher good. And you just keep on attracting and you get part, be part of my high vibe tribe. And let's, let's uh, be high vibe. Let's raise the energy around us. Um, because there's nothing better than uh, being around people who are genuinely happy and uh, happy for you and support you and love you. Okay. So, um, yeah. Maintain the vision, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, I hope that you'll like it. I hope you subscribe to my channel. And uh, these cards that I use today, I'm going to put them down below in the description box. And I hope you guys have an amazing day. And I hope you'll join me next time. So until then, bye.